I'm going to break it down. So from when you're at full pool or above for flood, flood risk management operations, you're actually flowing water out. And so flood operations becomes really the highest focus area at that time. Then from full pool down to drought trigger level one, you can service all the authorized purposes equally. From drought trigger level one to drought trigger level two, recreation becomes a higher focus because you're trying to keep those ramps in place a little bit longer to allow people to have access to the water as well as the recreation areas and the beaches. And then once you get beyond drought trigger level two and between drought trigger level two and drought trigger level three, you start seeing things change where uh, water quality, water quantity, and fish and wildlife management surface as a focus. And then of course, you know, during the drought, different drought trigger levels, one of the other misunderstandings is, is that we're flowing the rates to meet downstream requirements, but we're using the water efficiently by flowing the water through the turbines to generate hydropower.